ഹായ് മൈ ഡിയർ വൺസ് എ കൂൾ മോർണിംഗ് ടു വൺ ആൻഡ് ഓൾ വെൽക്കം ടു സോഷ്യൽ സയൻസ് ക്ലാസ് ടുഡേ വി ആർ ഗോയിങ് ടു കണ്ടിന്യൂ ദ സെയിം ലെസൺ ദ സ്ട്രഗിൾ ഫോർ ഇൻഡിപെൻഡൻസ് ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് റീകോൾ വിച്ച് വി ഹാവ് ലേൺ ലാസ്റ്റ് ക്ലാസ് ദ റൈസ് ഓഫ് ഇന്ത്യൻ നാഷണലിസം അൺഹാപ്പി ആൻഡ് ഡിസപ്പോയിൻറ്റഡ് വിത്ത് ദ ബ്രിട്ടീഷ് റൂൾ a few educated indians came forward to form the indian national congress in 1885 in the beginning the congress made moderate demands like the participation of indians in the government later some members of the indian national congress started demanding swaraj or self rule for the indians dear children shall i ask one question are you ready okay name the freedom fighter who said swaraj is my birthright and i shall have it yes bal gangadhar tilak right answer very good now let us move on with today's topic the partition of bengal and the swadeshi movement in 1905 why did the british think of partitioning bengal do you know listen to suppress the growing sense of nationalism and unity among the indians the british decided to divide the indians on the basis of their religion they divided the state of bengal which was the main center of the nationalist movement into east bengal for the muslims and west bengal for the hindus next is swadeshi movement what was the swadeshi movement the indians strongly opposed the op- partition of bengal this led to the swadeshi movement in 1905 what do i mean by the word swadeshi which means of one's own country swadeshi means of one's own country so people boycotted the goods made in britain and started using things made only in india do you know what do you mean by the word boycott which means to refuse to buy a product or take part in an activity to express one's opposition to something listen children what was the swadeshi movement the indian strongly opposed the partition of bengal this led to the swadeshi movement in 1905 people boycotted the goods made in britain and started using things made only in india is it clear okay next we can discuss about activities of the revolutionaries do you know about the revolutionaries okay ma'am will explain several young indians were willing to take up arms against the british and sacrifice their lives for the freedom of their country they were called revolutionaries listen several young indians were willing to take up arms against the british and sacrifice their lives for the freedom of their country they were called revolutionaries baron gosh Kudiram Bose, Bhagat Singh, Sukhdev, Rajaguru, Chandrasekhar Asad and Uddham Singh were some of the prominent leaders or revolutionaries. All of you say once more their names. Yes, Baran Gosh, Kudiram Bose, Bhagat Singh, Sukhdev, Rajaguru, Chandrasekhar Asad and Uddham Singh were some of the prominent leaders or revolutionaries. is it clear okay dear children have you heard about world war 1 yes okay now let us discuss about world war 1 and after world war 1 broke out in 1914 and many indian soldiers fought on behalf of the british thousands were killed the indians thought that this would make the british grant freedom to india but the british became harsher towards the indians they imposed 
more taxes to recover the losses they had incurred in the war dear children can i ask one question are you ready okay in which year world war 1 broke out yes world war 1 broke out in 1914 right answer at that time mahatma gandhi came back to india from south africa in 1915 he joined the indian national congress and the struggle for freedom soon he became one of the main leaders of the indian freedom struggle under his leadership the freedom movement spread to all over india when did gandhi ji come back to india from south africa yes in 1915 gandhi ji came back to india from south africa do you understand okay now let us summarize what we studied today to weaken the feeling of nationalism among indians the british divided bengal on the basis of religion in 1905 this led to the swadeshi movement world war 1 broke out in the year 1914 the british became harsher towards the indians after world war 1 gandhi ji returned to india from south africa in 1915 and joined the freedom struggle hope you all have understood this topic all should read the lesson very carefully write down the notes and learn okay thank you and have a nice day